let's talk about the value of the reactive stage with the Rico collaboration solution in an engineering architecture or any type of creative marketplace. So in these type of markets, most people who come to meetings have lots of rich media as content. People are presenting ideas, PowerPoint presentations and videos, and this is where we really shine. So if I jump into a sample presentation of an architectural firm, so one of the first things that I can do is I can take any type of content and automatically arrange it. This is very powerful for a customer or people in a meeting to immediately compare documents like here granite samples are being compared. And I can take that content and throw it right into a projector. I can switch that content very quickly and easily. And as I remove content, all of the tiles rearrange back with one click of a button. So the next concept I want to show you is how easy it is to create things like mood boards inside the stage solution. So this is a very common thing that in many creative fields mood boards are used and they are used to go ahead and compare color schemes, textures, patterns, font sizes, layouts in order to make sure that the team is going the right way. So here's a good example. If I have a plan for a kitchen, let's very quickly create a mood board where I bring in granite samples. I have a countertop and I'm navigating through my folder structures and I can pick up color schemes. And by clicking one button, I generate a screenshot. And here's my mood board. And on top of that, I can come in, I can very quickly annotate, I can do any additional information on top that is required. Now normally, in a, in a meeting, you would take all of this content, go into Photoshop, go into Word, go into Paint, composite all of these images together, which would waste many minutes. So Stage is very powerful at facilitating this type of interaction. So the next thing that I want to show you is our native inking capability. So here we have a PowerPoint document. And I'm going to generate some notes as to the changes that we want. Now if I save this document, instead of saving out a PDF file or a set of JPEGs, we generate a brand new PowerPoint image and if I go into that directory, it's my original document with all the ink overlaid in as manipulatable objects. So this becomes very powerful because I get to work in the media of my choice. If I started in Word, I continue the discussion in Word back at my desk. I'm not printing out documents and reiterating all of the annotations or transcribing them. I can simply save this document, email it to the team, and they would, uh, they would have it instantaneously. Now, another powerful feature is the ability for a stage to maintain revision history. I mentioned before that the original document is never modified. So I can go back in the next meeting and compare my changes against the original document. Now, on top of that, if I wanted to create additional changes, what actually happens is Stage understands what was old ink and what was new ink. It will not let you delete old ink because that's how we work with paper. We write down on a piece of paper and we maintain the auditability of that piece of paper, especially in a meeting. So if I make additional changes and save it, it creates a brand new file, which is the combination of this meeting and previous meeting, such that I actually have the entire trail of thought that occurred from meeting to meeting to meeting, and I can send all of the files out to my team instantaneously.